Okay, so my friend suggested to play episode, and that's what I'm going to do. So it says I prefer to date guys or girls. I'm going to go with girls because I'm not with that. Tonight is the biggest night of our life. <laughs> it's already starting off dramatic. Like, come on now. The night that the princess's bride will finally be chosen. So you don't know who the fuck. All right. My lady. I've come to fetch you, my lady. It's, it is time. My name is going to be bad as bitch. It looks like you entered an appropriate... Fuck you. <laughs> like, come on now. Don't start with me. Um, um fuck. Alright, this is going to be a while. Alright, so this is going to be my motherfucking name. And they better not have a problem with it. Would you like to customize your character's feature? Uh, she looks good already. Perfection. <laughs> I peeked into the, the throne room. It seems the entire world is here to see who the king is. Oh, wait, who the king will choose to marry his daughter. Are you ready? Am I? I'm the ordinary girl who shouldn't never be allowed, been allowed to, I can't fucking read today, <laughs> allowed to complete for the princess's hand. And yet you've made it this far. Now I just need to be, to find out who... <laughs> Find out if I've been chosen to marry the- I don't like this. <laughs> or she'll be thrown to another three weeks ago. What happened to this fat ass bitch? That was mean. Uh, we're live outside the palace of castle. The palace of castle? What the fuck? We're in the- We're in- 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 Charlie. What the fuck? I'm doing another story. I want to date girls, because like I said, I'm not with that gay shit. Great, let's start the story. Why would it be upsetting? You're in big trouble. What the fuck did I do? What started out as a, as a daring lesson quickly turned into something else. You know you had caught feelings when you started, when you stared at your hot boss's boss in the eyes. What the fuck? I cannot read. You couldn't help but wonder, will your feelings be reciprocated? Will you be brave enough to tell the truth or keep playing pretend? What the fuck was she wearing? And mostly important, just how far will these dangerous lessons be between you go? In this story, I don't give a fuck. So what's your name? Uh, since they wanna let me put badass bitch, it's gonna be baddie B again. Um, she looks fine already. Are you happy with how you look? Yep. Good morning, Mr. Dunley. Good morning. Choose your pronouns. It is ma'am. <laughs> um, <laughs> like. You know what? I'm not about to comment on that shit, Mr. Pres Miss Prescott. I wish you, <laughs> I wish you a lovely day at the office. As you step into the elevator, you notice four of the most influential women in the city leaving a board meeting, and one of them is headed straight for you, the company CEO. Um, take your time. Wait, hold on. Comment her ass down. Looks like she's sharing. Looks like I'm sharing the elevator with my boss today. I don't know what it's, a, what it's about. About wait, but it is about her. But she always makes me nervous. Hey, how are you? Good. Thing. Oh boy, here she go. Crap, she's not talking. Um, pretended it. Pretended it happened. Why did I even think she was talking to me? She never even spares me a second glance. Hey Cherry, thank, thank you for last night. I had so much fun, but they do last night. <laughs> no worries, Riley. I'm happy to do it again. Just tell me when. Really? Then maybe I'll give you a call this Saturday night. I'm really looking forward to it. Just met Miss Reed and Riley in the elevator. It sounds like they're hooking up. Gross, right? No. 
they definitely don't suit each other. I don't know if they do. I'm like, I'm <laughs> Miss Prescott? Oh, you're talking to me. No, she's talking to the motherfucking ceiling. Yes, you. I want to see you in my office in 15 minutes. Unless you're too busy spending, spreading lies. Oh, spreading lies about me to make it on time. She didn't see my message. Why the fuck you? Yeah, you about to get fired. Um, I don't appreciate. Um, it sure sounded like good to us. Um, lie to her, I guess. Your, that message was sent to your group chat that I've got access to as well. Oh boy. That was an accident, I swear. I was only supposed to message my best friend, were you? Not that it matters to you, but I was watching her relative while she was she went out for drinks. I'm not hooking up with her. If I, I could if I wanted to. Riley has been sending me inappropriate invites for quite some time now. Then why don't you two hook up? Why you so why so interested, huh? Um I like be honest. <laughs> I like to gossip. <laughs> um, fuck. Daddy B don't want you know. Okay. Let's continue this conversation in my office. Be there in 15 minutes and don't be fucking late. I really need to talk to my, to my best friend about what just happened. Shira, wasn't this the bitch in the last game? All right. Um, Shira is fun, loving, and crazy. Plus, her fashion sense is lit. Oh boy, I can tell this story is old. I need some spiritual advice, Sasha. Her fab, self-care vibes have recovered. BBS. What does that even mean? I don't give a fuck. <laughs> um, we're gonna go with uh, what's her name? Shira. What the heck, Bad B? Don't you know Miss Reed has access to our group chat? I wasn't thinking. I was in the elevator with her when it happened. She just confronted me about it. Matter of fact, let me think about it. Let me just mention that real quick. That was a long ass elevator ride. Where the fuck were they going? Oh no, you're so unlucky. Did you get in trouble? You got enough attraction, attraction points to share all about your elevator encounter. Oh, she didn't see that. That's the game telling me. Uh, not at all. She start. What? Did this bitch just lie? See, I, I read the part where she said I didn't get in trouble, but then this bitch gonna fucking sit here and lie. Look, bro, man, fuck it. She leaned over and called me a troublemaker. What the fuck she did? That lying ass. What? Tell me everything in detail. Okay, so what happened was, I forgot what I was supposed to say the second time. I saw her. Camilla. Um, yeah. Camilla, my cute co-worker. Are you okay? You stopped talking in a sentence and your tongue hanging out your mouth. You're not having a stroke, are you? What? No, I'm fine. You totally like Camilla, don't you? She's alright. I mean, she's not Miss Reed, but she's really cute. Trust me, no one likes Miss Reed. Everyone wants her. <laughs> oh, no one is like Miss Reed. Everyone wants her. Might as might as well go for second best. Yeah, but uh, but Camilla barely knows I exist. She's she's not gonna notice you if you don't talk to her. Oh my God, my fucking neck hurts. Uh, trust me, once you, once she, uh, do I gotta this? <laughs> like, I don't want to make this video too short, but I want to get somewhere in the game. Trust me, once she notice how amazing you are, she won't be able to keep her hands off, hands to herself, if you know what I mean. It's just that it's been a while since you know. Oh, I totally know. <laughs> what you mean? It's been a dry couple months for me, too. Months? Try years. 
Girl, you need to get it. That's how I imagine she said it. More than ever. I just don't have time for dates since I'm always working. I've definitely lost my touch. Well, I have to go for go. Miss Reed is waiting for me. Um, hi, you wanted to see me? Ah, uh, Miss Prescott, thanks for being punctual. Please take a seat before I drop kick you. Is there anything I can get you, Miss Reed? No, thanks. Please leave us. Sure thing. If there's anything you need, and I mean anything, just let me know. Nigga, let me know. Wow, her assistant, her assistant is really throwing herself at her. Alright, better defend my case quickly before Miss Reed fires me. Before you say anything, I want to point out that I'm one of your most hardworking employees, and I think it would be a big mistake to let me go. Trust me, I'm very aware of that. Why would you... I get a new fucking friend suggestion on Snapchat every day. Like, I don't even fucking use Snapchat like that. Um, why would you think I let you go? I thought that was why you wanted to see me in your office because of that message. Well, thank you for saying that, but I assure you that I'm not gonna, I'm not in the least bother about your little message, little bitch. I actually had fun confronting you about it. Oh. Did she just wink at me? I don't, th I don't think I've ever felt my heart beat so fast. Uh, um, should I ignore her? Ignore her. I asked you into I asked you into my office. What the fuck? I asked you into my office because I I like your work. I value your opinion, and I could use your, some help. Slime Brigade Two has has so many rave reviews since it came out last month and I know it couldn't have happened without your eye for detail will you take a look at some artwork I've got oh thank you yes of course wow she smells good <laughs> she smells good that perfume she's wearing is so ex en enticing I've only, I only wait if only she saw me as more than her employee you're hot. Excuse me? You're a hot commodity in our field right now. <laughs> Everyone's talking about your most recent endeavor. Yeah, that's endeavor. Which was a huge success. Oh, well, thank you. So, what do you think about the artwork? I really like the artwork, but I'm not sure about the colors. You're right, the lack of colors make it a bit dull, doesn't it? I've got a few more that I've i love for you to take a look at. Are you free for coffee after this after work? <laughs> yeah, sure. I don't have any plans. Great, I'll see you later then. Cool, it's a date. I mean, work date. Looking forward to it. Damn, she would she look mad as fuck. You don't really believe that you're going on an actual date, do you? You know, she would never choose someone as sad as you, right? I mean... Why, oh, th this is what I wanted to see. This is what I wanted to see. A bitch trying me. But you know, since this episode, we ain't never gonna get to fight. Because that's some bullshit. Why would she? Why would anyone? You must be talking to yourself. Because I'm a better person than you'll ever be. Um, yeah. <laughs> You're throwing yourself at her and she hasn't even spared you a second look. Oh, I'm so mad. <laughs> so how'd he go? Really well. She wanted me to take a look at some artwork for a new game. She, she said, oh, she said she values my opinion. We're going to meet up for coffee after work. Well, she asked you out on a date. I wish. We're not going on a date, though. We're, just, we're going to grab coffee and talk about work. A date disguised as work. As work thing. Oh, wait, as a work thing. Fuck, I can't fucking read. So, that's... That's no one, wait, that, so that no one at office talks, okay, or smart, whatever she said, Shira, Shira, you can't tell me you wouldn't want to hook up with her. She's my boss, you should never mix business with pleasure, says the girl who has been busted after Camilla for the last three months. 
That's completely different. We're co-workers and Camilla only dates models. Models? Please. We've both seen the lineup of people who visit Miss Reed's office to, to know that she has a type. Just because you aren't a model doesn't mean you can't dress like one. Am I still recording? Yeah. I say we go shopping for lunch after you buy some fun. Wait, after some something fun to wear for your... You know what? Whatever. A whole new wardrobe will surely make you feel like a straight up boss. Damn, I should have said that in a Rick Ross voice. <laughs> um, <laughs> and if it happens to turn out, turn Miss Reed's head too, then so be it. Dang, you look so freaking hot. Between the new apartment, between the new apartment and the outfit, you'll have a total movie maker moment. With a hot new look to get all the eyes on me, it'll, yeah. it's finally my time to shine. I should, um, I don't have no more fucking diamonds. I think I'll just wear what I had on. Wow. I'm glad you wanted to join me tonight. You look great. I can't believe she just said that. I should. It's too risky. Just be friendly. Thank you. That's very kind of you to say. Um, Miss Reed, this is a bar. I thought you said we were going to grab coffee. I know, and we are. Where can I get you two? Two coffees, please. Make them Irish. Yeah. I don't know why I keep doing that. <laughs> I've never had one of those. Are they good? It's coffee with sugar, cream, and whiskey. Of course it's good. I don't know what kind of flavor you're into, but I like it. Wait, what? Why don't you try it? Okay. Wow, this tastes... I don't know. Like, what? They should have just fucking said that shit for me. Like, why the fuck am I choosing if it tastes good or not? Maybe you should finish the one you had first. Right, good idea. So, should we find find a table and start working, Miss Reed? Please, Batty Reed. Don't... <laughs> no need to, to be so formal. We're out of the office. You just call me Cherry. Oh, okay, Cherry. That's better. Is it Cherry or Sherry? I, like, I don't even know what it is. <laughs> hey, looks like that table is free. Let's go. So, did you bring the artwork? I'm excited to see them. I just had so much to do, I completely forgot about it. It's alright. How about we get it together in my office tomorrow instead? You're not leaving, are you? Since we're not working. Of course not, I'd be happy to stay. I can't stay out for long though. I have to get to bed quick early, quite early. Are you always this boring? Excuse me? You heard me. I'm not boring. Then stay and prove it. What the fuck? See, this that bullshit this game be on. Like, what the fuck? Like, I... <laughs> Fine, I guess I'm boring. Let's go to the bar and get you a soft drink then. Where the fuck did she... She didn't even drink it. She put it up to her cheek. Is that Camilla? Who the fuck is that again? Oh my god, Camilla is here. Hey, what are you guys doing here? I brought... <laughs> I brought Batty B out to, to discuss something, something work related. Wow, I've never seen Camilla outside the office. Cause you know I do look a lot there. Oh, <laughs> um, uh, play hard to get. See if you know. Okay, I was gonna say, cause I do look a lot different outside my work clothes. How's it going, Camilla? One of those days, you know. Are you with anyone? I like to invite you to join us, but I need some some time alone with Batty B. And when I say Batty B, I ain't talking about Cardi B, cause that hoe is trash. That's okay. I'm I'm meeting my ex. She wanted to talk about something important. Well, I'm pretty sure it's a trick to get back together. I see. Don't you want to get back? Do you want to get back together with her? Hell no. Why the fuck did they send her? They like hell no. She hooked up with my best friend right in front of me. 
I got home from work early, and then, and they were going at it like rabbits in the living room. <laughs> Ouch, that's tough. I'm sorry. It is. What is it like? Oh, what is it? Wait. I don't even know what the fuck that shit said. Well, I'm not going to bother you anymore. I'll see you at the work office tomorrow. Are you checking her out? I mean, to be honest, like, um, like, since she liked both of them, they should just Nicki Minaj. That's all. <laughs> uh, what? Not a, not a, wait, what? No, of course not. Fuck, I can't read. You're so busted. You like her, don't you? Be honest. Maybe a little. She's kind of cute. She'll never be interested in me anyway. Maybe you, you were right before about me being boring. You're not boring. Come on. Where are we going? To the karaoke section of the course. We of course. <laughs> we need to kick this party off, do we? Then we're going to to dance our butts off until we're all sweaty. What the fuck? I promise you <laughs> I promise you that you're that you're gonna have the time of your life tonight. I can't believe Terry wants to dance with me. What are these weird feelings I'm having? I think I want to I want to go all in tonight with my hot boss. I should. Oh, I should. What the Oh boy. You know what? That's gonna be the last choice and I'm gonna end the video off because this game is pissing me off. What the fuck? Damn, I thought she was gonna say something. You just teleported. Thanks for walking me home. Of course. You look like you had fun tonight. Did we? Like, nigga, I teleported. Um. Yeah, too bad the night has to end. Unless you want to come in for a while. Oh my god, did I just ask her that? I must. It must be the alcohol talking. That depends. What do you have to offer? I don't know. What you're talking, what you're thinking about right now, but uh, I was thinking about food or talking about food. Oh, Batty B, I'm your boss. It, it would be very unprofessional of me to pursue you. Of course, I don't, I don't know what I was thinking. Don't worry about it. I'm gonna head home. Oh shit, I didn't finish reading it, but whatever. Thanks again for the fun night. Me, me too. Bye, Batty B. If if I weren't your boss, I would take you up on that offer. <laughs> Which offer? You figure it out. Okay, I'm in the motherfucking video. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, leave some comments, hit the bell notification shit, do all that good motherfucking shit. And I'll see you next time.